Happy first day of meteorological spring, WestCon. This is senior student meteorologist Eric Gauff, and thanks so much for tuning into this latest edition of Eric's Weather Outlook. Well, we're not starting off the first day of meteorological season all that well as we do have overcast skies in the region and the great, greater Danbury area, and that's going to lead to some showers that will enter the region tonight, but improvements are on the way with mostly sunny skies throughout the latter part of this work week before unsettled weather looks to return for this upcoming weekend. Right now, our temperature is at 35 degrees with a 52% humidity with the southeast wind at 5 miles per hour. And that southeast wind is helping to moderate these temperatures a bit into rather seasonable territory with 39 in New London, 33 in Hartford, which is sitting at 32 in Torrington, and New York City is sitting at the warm spot, which is 40 degrees. Like I said, we're going to have a few showers into the region, mostly during the early portions of tonight, and we should be drying out by later on during midnight and clearing out throughout the night as an area of low, weak low pressure does pass just to our north and that will set stage for a rather quiet finish to the work week with again mostly sunny skies before a gloomy day is on tap for Sunday with overcast skies and showers persisting throughout that day. Now we may be cloudy but at least we're dry for the time being in Danbury indicated by the star right there but like I said showers are going to move into the region later on tonight and they will be light and this mass of clouds does extend all the way to the west through the Great Lakes region with this area of low pressure and it is a weak and moisture starved low pressure system that will be moving through just to the northwest and giving us a few light showers for tonight. And we could time this out with one of our high resolution computer forecast models. This is as of today at 7 p.m. we could see the main threat of showers entering the region and they will be light and we should be drying out by around 11 p.m. or midnight or so and then after that we will be clearing out those skies and seeing a rather nice day for tomorrow. Today we'll have a seasonable high of 42 degrees with that south wind at 5 to 15 miles per hour. It will be mostly cloudy and we do have a chance of showers by around 5 p.m. or so but the main threat of showers does come tonight around that 7 p.m. time frame with the southeast wind at 5 to 15, turning to a northwest wind as a weak cold front does push through associated with that system, but it will be weak and it won't drop our temperatures that much. And actually will be a little warmer for your day on Wednesday, 44 degrees with partly sunny skies. A more moisture starved and weaker system does look to pass through the region Wednesday night. Low chance of precipitation, but I can't rule out a few sprinkles, maybe even a wet snowflake mixed in with that. But we will be dry on Thursday with mostly sunny skies, 38 degrees, a little cooler on Friday, 34 with mostly sunny skies. The clouds do thicken on Saturday with mostly cloudy skies. And then Sunday, mid 40s, but is looking gloomy with overcast skies and showers persisting throughout the day. Please don't forget to follow us on social media. I'm senior student meteorologist Eric Gauff. Thank you so much for watching and enjoy the rest of your day.